We just had a 10 year auction at the top of the hour. Rick Santelli's out in Chicago. How'd it go, sir? Nasty auction here. It tailed three basis points. Let's start at the beginning. We're looking at 42 billion 10 year notes. And the yield, 3.96. 3.96. Where was the when issued market? Basically, 3.93. So the auction had a higher yield, which means a lower price. The government was a seller, three basis point tail. That alone is a huge grade uh, killer in terms of the demand. It's straight up one o'clock Eastern. Now, if we go through it, uh, what I find fascinating is the bid to cover 2.32, Kelly, was the weakest bid to cover since December of 22. The dealers took almost 18%, the most they've taken since April of 24. The only metric that was above its 10 auction average just barely were indirect bidders. Direct bidders were light. As I said, pricing was hugely weak. You now look at a 10-year, uh, you can see that the yield has moved up to the highest yields of the day. On that three-day chart, what you really need to notice is 3.66, which the intraday low on that wild Monday. And here we sit just a handful of basis points away from 4%. And it really does give us testament that when you fly away from the flight to safety trade on Monday, it tells us that the United States probably wasn't at the epicenter of all that volatility. And if you look at the yen since Monday, of course, it has been going down for three couple of consecutive days here. And if you put that overlay against 10-year yields or any yields, what you'll see is that relationship just screams that the carry trade most likely was the epicenter of the anxiety. I fully suspect that the long-dated yields here have suffered because of this pullback Wait till we see what that 30-year looks like tomorrow. Back to you.